Hey guys, welcome to a new video. Today I would like to present my new Dabauer Daily Dimate. Um, last year in October, November, I already presented the first Daily Dimate, which was an invention from my side, where I created a small tool which allows safe and very easy deleting of CPUs. Uh, previously, well, before the Daily Dimate existed, people used to use either a vise or a razor blade, which works but still has um, quite a lot of risks um, so because you can cut with a razor blade um, into the CPU PCB which can then damage your CPU permanently that's why originally I created the Daily Dimate and so this is the new version of the Daily Dimate uh, it's called Simple uh, Daily Dimate 2 and it's made out of um, anodized aluminium black anodized with a small laser engraving on the side with my nickname the principle is the same so you have the base where you put the CPU inside and you have a small slider which then pushes the IHS to the side to delete the CPU um, I will show in detail how it works I just have to um, unmount the camera and put it closer here so you can see in detail how it works all right I will show you now how you can uh, use this tool to delete your CPU so this is the base of the delete I made and here we have a i7 7700K Kaby Lake CPU. This is the slider which will delete the CPU. This is a screw and this is the tool for regluing. So first of all uh, take the CPU, the 7700K and make sure you put it in the right direction. So there is a small triangle on the left corner you can see here and there is also a small triangle on the delete diamond you can see here. Now put the CPU in the delete diamond according to the triangles so they match and now take the slider, slide it in to the delete diamond and tighten the slider using the screw. Now take the hex key and carefully tighten the screw. It, it's very easy and you only need like one or two rotations uh, to delete and you can see it's already deleted now. Time to remove the screw so you can remove the slider and then you can take out the CPU and see that it's already safely deleted. What you can do now is remove the towel paste on the IHS and also on the CPU, remove the glue and clean everything. You can replace the terminal paste for example with liquid metal and afterwards you have to re-glue. So put the CPU back into the Dilidimate um, yeah, make sure you put the glue on the IHS, that's the way I do it usually. Put the IHS back onto the CPU and yeah, by the way, for the final product there will be a small piece of plastic which will go under, well, from the side to the CPU so it will align the IHS perfectly to the CPU. This part is not ready yet so I cannot show it in this video but um, yeah, so take the re-gluing tool, unscrew it a little bit so you have more space put it over the Daily Dimate and start, start tightening the screw. Once you notice that it's getting a little bit tighter, only do a half more rotation and that's it. That should be fine. Don't apply too much pressure. Now leave it in there for like 30 minutes and then you can put the CPU back into the mainboard. So as you could see, the deleting and also regluing process is extremely easy using the new Delete Dimate 2. Previously, the Delete Dimate was not really available globally. So in the US, the availability was uh, not that good. So this time we will have availability in the US, but it will take around four to six weeks from now until you have availability. So just be patient, but I will make sure that there will be global availab availability of this tool. Yeah, if you have any questions about the Daily Dimate, uh, just let me know in the comments. One thing I would like to point out quickly is the fact that this is a pre-production sample. So there are few th a few details which will change uh, for the final product. For example, some corners will be uh, rounded a little bit and also the screw um, will change. This is not the final screw. This was just something I used uh, to try the tool. The screw will change. Um, but it's nothing you have to worry about. Um, um, essentially, the final product quality will be even better than this. Also, the packaging will look very nice. So, yeah, just let me know what you think about the tool. Put some comments uh, down below if you have any questions. Otherwise, take care. See you soon.